as a busy mom, I can understand that it is difficult at times to get a workout in. So what I want to encourage you to do is start to just work on getting more movement into your days. And one of the best things that you can do is start working on the floor um, by stretching. That's an easy way to get movement. Don't think of movement so much as exercise always, but rather how can you make your body move through different positions. And um, this week I want you to try just getting on the floor and stretching some more. And there's one stretch that I was doing this weekend and I noticed something and I thought it was interesting and wanted to share with you. So all I want you to do is take your feet and stretch them out in front just like you would do like a hamstring stretch. And when you reach forward, um, thinking of the things that we should think of, we want to one, not curl our pelvis under. We want to start working on trying to push our pelvis forward also not rounding our back, trying to push our chest towards our toes. But as you do that, look down at your knees and notice if there's a difference in where they are. So if I'm looking at both of my knees and I go reach for my toes, I see it's more difficult with these leggings on. If you go with shorts, you'll be able to see it probably a little bit more. But I see where this knee is out in front of this knee. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna work on pushing my knee back into alignment with my other knee, and I'm gonna feel where I feel that stretch. So mine comes up deep in here, um, guessing psoas area. So pay attention to that when you're stretching See if you notice anything, especially with this hamstring stretch, do you notice where your knees aren't in alignment with one another? Are they not together? And then try to create alignment and see what you notice within your body. What area of your body is tight?